Hello, welcome to my channel. Let's talk today about high key vision email notification. As you can see, I have my camera working via web browser and I want to send a notification every time there is motion in front of the camera. So it's pretty easy. You just need to come here to the configuration menu and look for the email account, right? So you can come here to the network, advanced settings and email. And here you just need to fill all this information, the sender, sender address, SMTP server. You need to get this from your mail provider. Okay, I have mine here already. SMTP port, in this case it's 465. That's the secure port using SSL, the secure socket layer. And here the authentication, just check here, input the username, password, I repeated the password here, and the receiver name and address, okay? So that's the basic configuration I have to do for email, all right? And then here I have my email account ready to receive email from the camera. And I need to test first the email part and then later conf configure the motion detection, all right? So back here, I've just hit test and wait for the camera to send a testing email, right? So to make sure it's working before I configure the motion detection. So it takes a while. It's just communicating with the server, testing the authentication and everything else. And if it works, I'm going to receive an email to confirm that's working. And after that, I go to the camera for the configuration of motion, right? So wait for it. And here we go. Testing succeed. I'm just come here to my email account to confirm. Here we go. I have a filter here for high vision camera and just got this test email. So this is a test mail from IP camera. Pretty good. It's working. Right? Let me just delete this so I can receive other emails with test with notification. Come back here to the camera. Now I need to go to event. And here I can enable motion detection for this camera. And I can select where the camera is supposed to detect motion. Or I can select everywhere. I can just draw an area here or clear all the area. It's up to you. Adjust the sensitivity as well. And most important, you need to come here to linkage method and enable send email okay and here trigger recording a1 that's it save it and now every time there's motion in front of the camera i'm going to receive an email right here we go so let me just come back here and wait for the email to come and here we go the first email arrived high vision camera ip camera uh, motion detection and I, when I open here, I have all the information, okay? Motion detection, the time, IP camera, name, high vision, and things like that. So it's basically working. But I still don't have here the picture, right? I can also go to the camera and configure the camera to send pictures when there's a motion. So I'm going to do that. I'm just delete these emails, just the test one. Come back here to configuration and look for the information where I can attach the email, right? So you need to come back here to network, advanced settings, email again, and here you have this option to attach image, okay? Uh, interval, two seconds, and just hit save. And I'm gonna wait again to receive new emails. So I'll come back here to live view, just to see that the image is working, there are cars passing by there, generating motion. Here we go, I'm supposed to get some pictures from this motion detection, right? Let me just come here. Nothing yet because I just configured the camera. Let's just wait. And here we go. After some time, I received the email. I have the attachment. I just click here and I see the pictures, right? When I click here, I see three of them because there's motion detection when the car is passing by, okay? So pretty interesting, it's working fine. And now I have my camera just detecting emails, uh, detecting motion and sending email for notification, okay? So that's all for today. If you like this video, please subscribe to this channel, leave your thumbs up and your comments, and I see you in the next one.